What's going on, everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com. And in the last video, we took on Louisville. At the time, they were ninth in the country. Close game, a lot of back and forth. We ended up losing last play of the game. I just made a bad throw. But name of the game was, it was just a lot of turnovers. We were fortunate to be as close as we were for as many turnovers as we had. But we got to move on. And today, we're taking on Ohio. A little more even matchup. They are a 4-3 defense, and they are like run a balanced offense. I checked the playbook. It's just a lot of ace and gun. It looks like they run the ball very well. So I'm guessing they got an impact running back. We're going to try to shut down as best we can. We'll see how that goes. I think I may run some more 4-6. Um, the 46 defense on those rundowns. I just now, that just now occurred to me. Either way, just looking here, I mean, this could be another tough game for us. We'll see. As long as we don't turn the ball over 100 times, I think we could be okay, though. Go to NC's recruiting. Anytime you lose, it doesn't really help you a whole lot on the recruiting front. Looks like we got a player that took us off our list altogether. Looks like it's just corner out of Prattville, Alabama, so we don't have to worry about him. That leaves us nine points to play with, but let's go down the list here. Pedro Thompson, we're still at the top of the list for this guy. Good shape, we just don't have a clue what he likes. Uh, we don't have to worry about that quarterback. We decided not to go with him. Uh, so it looks like 10 points isn't enough to recruit John Watkins. I am not going to go after him. I, could, I mean, I could dump all my points on him, but th we got other fish to fry, and it looks like we got other players that we're going after that we may be at the bottom of their list as well. Uh, but I'm going to wait and take the points off for now. Let me just see some of these other players. Like, here's another example. Matt Russell, a guard out of uh, Smyrna. We're at the bottom of the list, and the nine or the 10 points we're putting on him just isn't enough. Makes you wonder if Notre Dame, Tennessee, Georgia, Virginia Tech are doing 15 points, 20 points. Not real sure, but it looks like spreading my points isn't going to work right now. We moved up for Alan Upshaw. Looks like 13 points is more than enough to keep going after him, which is good. Left guard, we're at the top of the list. We're still in great shape for him. We don't have to worry about the free safety. Here's a left tackle. We're still doing okay for him. We must have been in second place. Now we're dropped down to, like, with the rest of everybody else. Well, let's keep going. Left outside linebacker. See, we're just dead last for this guy. So is it, like, is it worth it? Other thing is, I need some really good speed at outside linebacker and a 4-6. Don't know if it's going to cut it for me even at the G5 level, so I don't mind just taking the points off of him altogether. Another wide receiver out of Alabama is just not enough, so I can decide to go after one of those two receivers. Like, here's just middle linebacker. It's just not good enough. The dive points we're putting on him, or the 10. Uh, I would really like to have this kid. He's smart, and he's got some speed to him. What we can try to do, I don't know if it's just too late. Let's decide on which receiver to go after. C minus and B plus hands, but he's fast. Then you got C plus and B plus for hands, 4, 3, 5. I'd like to at least try my hand at one of the two. Now let's go for the local kid for now. Let's try 20. And then we'll take the points off this guy. We'll go after one, not both. We'll end up losing both. And if I'm not, oh, one thing I need to do, and then I thought about this. Uh, let's go right here and just make sure pitch feedback is still okay for a lot of these. We're in great shape with the quarterback. We're not bothering with him. I'm just making sure I'm not wasting my time on one of these kids. Okay, so we're still good to go for that. So I got 10 more or 17 more points to play with. This left guard, well, we can still try to go after him. We're putting 10 points here. Let's do... Let's do 15 and see if that's enough for some of these guys. We're going to go 15 here. We got a, still a decent shot for this tackle. If you look at our... We need tackle help big time. Let's go 15 here. We got... Let's try 15 for this linebacker. See if that puts us in his good graces. If not, then we'll just move on. So we got 10 more or 5 more points. Which guard do we need to go after? I'd rather just go after one at this point. 
Both of them are smart. A awareness, 455 and 640. Then you got 455 and 640. So it's literally the exact same player. This guy's a little taller. Uh, one thing I do need to take it to a can Well, they're both really slow. 524, so it doesn't matter. I was thinking, you know, when I pull guards with counter lead and such. But it looks like it's not going to matter. We're definitely going to go after this guy. Because he's at the top. We're at the top of his list. We'll just put all of our, our eggs in his basket. Let's take points off of this guy. That gives us 10 more points. Uh, we can try. I still want to... Let's put 10 here and 10 here. Or 5 there and 5 there. We got our best chance going at getting this kid right here and getting the quarterback. If we could get those two and nobody else, I would be halfway okay with regular season recruiting because that's at least a good base for our offense before we head into the offseason. I wouldn't mind getting a defensive guy. Like this kid right here would be great. But as you can tell... We are down to nothing but offensive players. That's just kind of the way it worked out. But thankfully, we got the offseason to deal with the rest of that. So I'm okay with all of that. All right, let's go to the ESPN, the magazine. I don't really care about any of this, except we'll go to the team info screens. And we'll look at our screen. We don't have anybody injured. Hopefully, nobody will get in trouble today. Uh, it's gross. One thing I really want to try to do is see if we can run the ball a little bit better today. The way we've had the last couple games. So I'm a little concerned about the running game in this in 07. Uh, I just need to play more games with it. It's almost like it's an all or nothing type deal. We'll just see how that goes. Uh, I want to check out who are we playing today? Yeah, it's a Mac school. So let's go uh, right here. Ohio. They don't have anybody in trouble or anybody injured. Their quarterback isn't playing too well, but they got a running back that's averaging 180 yards a game. Hopefully we can slow that down somehow. They just got beat by Northern Illinois. Okay, uh, one thing I do need to do, it just now occurred to me, we can do it now since it's on my mind. We're going to change pro normal or pro slot to... Uh, we could probably do pro twins. I can go back to it for now. Let's just do that. I, I completely forgot that I needed to change that out. Because I just wasn't getting much out of pro slot. Okay. Let's get into it. Nobody's in trouble. So let's get this show on the road. <coughs> They're a little bit highly rated than us. They're 86 and we're 93. Looks like they got a couple outside linebackers. Putting up good numbers. As long as I don't see a ton of turnovers due to goofy things. I'm going to be okay with it. Go right to the coin toss. They won it, and they will get the ball first, which is fine. Looks like we got another rain game. This worries me. I, that's another thing. You just don't have a clue if rain really affects this or not. I played plenty of rain games in the past, and you can't really tell if it affects it. But either way, looking at the quarterback situation, okay player, but he can't run, so we can go after him. But their bread is buttered with this guy right here. He's arguably the top running back in their conference. Not very fast, but he's really strong. Not the biggest guy. Everything it looks like is going to go through him. They got an impact receiver, though, that's technically more talented than him, so it makes you wonder if they're going to throw a little bit more than run. According, I got the strategy guide for this game, and I think they had a 60% run to 40% pass, but a lot of that depends just on where your talent lies. They got a tight end that's okay, but he can't run or anything. Let's look at their offensive line. Looks like your typical Mac offensive line. 4-3 defense, 82 there, and 82 on the other end. Then you got defensive tackles, not too bad. Uh, linebackers, uh, middle linebackers, impact player. So far, their front seven looks fairly stout. Everybody's like in the 80s. Their corners look pretty good for the Mac, I guess. Okay, free safety. Okay, strong safety. I mean, they're just a... A decent little defense from what I can tell. Hopefully we can do some damage on them, though. Okay, I've seen enough. Let's play. The Middle Tennessee State Blue Raiders will be kicking off to start the game. Uh, we're going to go over here. I don't want that guy to catch it. 
82? Is that... I don't know who... Oh, that's their wide receiver, I think. They're going with a bigger set. We'll do the same. Looks like he dropped that. From what I can tell. Uh... We're going to do another one high. I'm thinking they're going to run the ball. That's a good stop there. <laughs> Only picks up, what, three? They're doing that. Uh, let's... We can... Uh, let's do quarters. Third and seven. I'll control a defensive lineman. <coughs> I don't know why I'm choking. Good defense. Somebody got a hand on it. <coughs> don't have to take a swig of water. Okay, that's a good start. Let's see if we can get an offense and have a clean drive out of the gate. No! Who? I... I was supposed to take him over. That was my fault. We're very fortunate we didn't fumble it there. Uh, let's do our... Let's do that. Get these out of the way. Or sub-packages. Let's go tight end corner. So they're going man. Now, I can leave this as is, or I can try to do that. Play action play that we didn't get to do in the last game. We'll do a slide protection to the left. Give it to him. That's a good start. We are on the right hash. I'm trying to think. One thing I've been wanting to do. <clears throat> I try to get my tight end going a little bit better than what we have. The problem is. I got him as my center beater throughout the whole thing. I'm going to have to find me some other plays. Let's. Uh. Let's have him go deep. I think they're going man. Intercepted. No. Why? <laughs> oh, I was. We had a jump the snap issue, so I had to get out of the way. I had to get it off quickly. And we're very fortunate he came down with it the way he did. That's just pure luck on that, you know, that situation. Let's go. Uh, we're on. 14 left hash. Let's go X post. I want to see if they go zone. I had her going man, which is fine. Going 5-2. No, 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 no. That's good defense. I shouldn't have thrown it to him. My halfback got caught. He got slowed down by my by that guy right there. Either way, that guy played great coverage on him, so I shouldn't have thrown it to him anyway. It's like should have went here. Or right there, and I just didn't. So let's stay in this formation. Let's go curl, half egg swing. They're going man. So were they going man or zone? Yeah, they went man. Just making sure that corner. What well, was weird? Don't know how that happened. He ended up over here. <laughs> Either way. That's a good start. We'll kick an extra point. We'll fill up the stadium eventually. Not a big crowd, but it'll come in time. I love to be able to kick away from their best player there. At least the impact guy. Back to defense we go. They are going to go two wide. Let's go back to that 46. Let's just do a basic one high. I 
I was able to get jump the snap, but he got in my way. I, you notice me right here. That's one of the things with jump. Yeah, well, I guess it depends on where your angle is. Kudos to the quarterback getting the ball off in time. They're doing that. I'm going to stick with another one high. They're throwing the ball more than I expected, but maybe it's because, like I said earlier, they got a impact receiver that's actually better than the running back. That's a good stop there. Somebody was able to come through. Third and five. Ah, geez, what do you do here? Uh, let's try this monster three. Yeah, let's do it from here. I'm okay with that. I have no clue what to expect here. Not used to this particular play. Um, oh, he caught that. You gotta be kidding. He tipped it into his hands. Uh, let's try quarters. How lucky can he get? Come back. I don't like the way that looked. Fumble. Oh, uh, fumble went our direction. I hope we don't see so many of those today. We don't really need to... I don't want to see them. I don't mind seeing a couple here or that, but not six or seven like we saw in the last game. All right, let's go to deep comeback. They're going man, so I'm going to go back to our play-action play. I mean, this is a decent man-beater, but I prefer this one a little bit more. Uh, you... So we need to run the ball. Let's see. Let's try my basic option play, my toss. Now, one thing I need to start doing is slide protection. But I don't need to, need to bother with slide protection now since nobody moved. So we're going to get a touchdown out of this. So that gives me a little bit of hope that you can still run the ball. Some. He tossed it left-handed. <laughs> I know he's a lefty, but... <laughs> when you run a West Coast offense, for me personally, I, I tend to forget that, hey, I can run the ball quite a bit if I wanted to. It doesn't have to be all passing. And Bill Walsh would kill me right now. He'd be turning over his grave if he knew if I was running his offense but throwing as much as I have been. So this may be the last game... I'll play on six-minute quarters. I just think it's too long for me. And if you notice my stats offensively the last couple games, you can go back and look. They're pretty high. Like, I'm easily getting close to 500 every game, and that seems a little too much. Unless my offense is going flawless. Like, I almost had 500 yards of offense against Louisville with seven turnovers. Now, how is that possible? Nowhere to go, nowhere to run. I like to see the running back try to do at least a little something. They're doing that. Uh, let's take a chance on a zone blitz. They may go back to running it. I'm just going to leave it as is. I think that was a smart play. I just stayed back in coverage. I didn't think I was going to be able to get to the quarterback in time. We'll give her 4-3 a bit of a break, and let's do cover three from Nickel. Third and long gets a little bit more speed out there. I am not going to do jump the snap. I'd rather go around the guy. Or he could just mow me over. Oh my gosh, he still caught that. Okay. Back. Square one we go. First and ten. Ball on the 44 yard line. Do that. That was quite congested. He did have five straight completions, and then that went away. Uh, let's. 
go under. Let's do lightning gold. Let's see if my under is correct. Uh, we need to flip it. There we go. That's more like it. Uh, I could have went after the guy. I backed out into coverage with my defense tackle. That didn't make a lot of sense. We're going to go 4-6, crash gold. That's 13 inches. Even if they don't get this, I can see them going for it. That's a glitch. I don't know why it does that. That's a good stop. Now, are they going to go for it? They're going to punt. I'm going to do an all-out block just so everybody can get out of the way. And if they go for it, I don't blame them. Now i got full control over the returner. I can fair catch it on time. Everybody get out of the way. That's a good spot right there. Middle of the field. Well, let's go here and... I want to try counter. Oh, we're on the left side. I thought we was in the middle of the field. Okay, that didn't make a lick of sense. If I'd have known they was going to do that, I would have went like more of an inside run. And here we go. Fumbles. Ooh, okay, left hash. Where are we? Left hash. Uh, I'm going to go back. Let's go strong normal. Let's go flanker curl. They're going man. I'm going I wanted them to go zone. Give me a chance to go to my tight end, but... Dang it! Dang it! Somebody came through! Jump the snap! Jump the snap! And that wasn't even him that came through. So it's third and one. Um, I'm going to go back to our toss play. I like the shift. Yes, I like it even better now. We can try that. There we go. Get to the outside a bit. Pick up the first. Now we're on the right hash. We can try. I wonder. Let me go. Can I put my tight end in here? Uh, there we go. Let's put him in here. Let's do... Curl flats. Go zone. All right, our tight end's going to get touched the ball, finally. Even if there's a hole over the middle, I'm still going to go to my tight end. Yay, he gets to catch the ball. Pick up the first down. Good for him. I was trying to find something where I could just give him the ball. Finally came up with something. I wonder if I can do my fullback sub package here. Fullback tight end, there it is. I want to run some air raid. Let's go Y-stick. All right, they're going zone. I like Y stick. This formation's pretty good for it, but sometimes you can get to your stick regardless of what they call. As you see right there, and he just made a bad throw. So it's 30 inches. We're going to try slam. And they're going 5 2. Everybody, their brother's going in that direction. We're going to go to the. Ah. Just pick up the first. <laughs> just barely. Just get in. So I feel like I'm forgetting a play call or two. Let's go. I don't mind getting my actual fullback in there. My true one. He can catch the ball okay. Let's do tight end corner. It's an old 06 staple. They're going man. They're, everybody and their brother's coming up. This will go to Ingram or Gross. Go gross. Ah. Well, we did get him off sides. That will be a first and five. And that should be in the quarter. Nope. The clock has stopped. So we got one more play left. Let's go slot corner. You're going zone here. This will go to our fullback. Ooh, I'm going to spread that out. Or it'll go to. The guy over the middle there. Ooh, that was pig six. So that's interesting how he... I waited too early. No, I threw it too early. That's why he was still sitting there. That should have been a pig six. We got lucky. That's why that guy plays defense, because he can't catch. Uh, 
So I threw that way too early, but the reason I threw it too early is what happened here? You guessed it. Uh, so where are we? It's into the first. Second and five. Uh... Just look in here. I may have to do another curl flat. I want to get my tidy on a touch again. Let's do curl flats from here. We're going zone, so he'll be able to touch it. Uh, I'm going to think I'm going to leave my protection as is. Just get him going. Now I want to try. We're on the right hash. Let's spread him out. Let's do a dive. Let's go up the middle some and see if we can run up the gut a little. We're going zone nickel. So I may be able to find a crease somewhere, like to the left. Just a eh, decent little run. Pick up five, maybe. Six yards. We can go... Let's go normal. Let's... Mm, I'm going to take... I'm going to try. Let's go toss. The actual toss. Now what I may have to do is I may move a wide receiver over. Like what we're going to do here. Now I'm going to do slide protection to the right see if that helps anything. I got enough to maybe get a touchdown. Oh, dude, he didn't, didn't get in. Dang it. That's a good run, though. So I'm glad to see the toss work a little. I wasn't patient enough. I should have just stopped and waited. But I don't think my guard... Or is he my tackle? He's my tackle. I don't think my tackle would have got to that guy in time. We are on the one. We can try ISO. <laughs> There's really no point in doing that. It just now occurred to me. I mean, why bother? Because it's not like you can get in the end zone uh, by doing that. So there was no point in me faking the snap. I was kind of doing to mitigate jump the snap a little. I like the way they were leaning, too. To the left. So they got to jump the snap. Destroyed my left guard. Yet my guard just plowed right over him. I just... <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Alright. So, again, six minutes. This will be my last six-minute game. We're already at 21 to nothing, and we're barely into the second quarter. I mean, am I going to put up 80? Right now, I don't feel like Ohio's doing a whole lot against me on defense. But there's a lot of game left. I'm sure they can come out right back and score. Their running back isn't doing anything. Like, I don't think he's broken a tackle yet. Which is a bit concerning. It, normally in 06, this guy would have busted a one or two by now. Like, he's just not going anywhere. We'll try zone blitz. We'll go this way. Pull back dive. I'm glad I came back, otherwise he would have gotten the first. So it's third and one. We'll go back to 46 Bear because that fits my roster best compared to the 4 4 goal line. Oops. They went play action. That surprised me. It's a good little play. Big gain right there. Going four wide. We'll go quarters. A neat little formation and an offset back. That's a good play right there. I didn't know who to defend, either the tight end over the middle or the swinging halfback. 
That's a little West Coast play out of the gun. I am going to go with another one high. If I was them, I would just run it. I kind of wish that safety would get closer to that guy, but he ain't going to. I got pushed back pretty easily. Ooh. Our zone blitzes, we can try that. Again, I don't remember how many sacks we got in the last game. That's another thing we're kind of struggling with. I could got to him there, but I, have, I feel like I have to do it myself. Second and 14. Let's just do quarters. And I may have to do quarters for my third down. That basic cover three, I've been struggling with it. Halfback draw. It's just that halfback just isn't doing anything for him. 1.1 average. That's not good. They're going two tight ends, so let's just do quarters. I'll play in coverage. Terrible throw. On the 41, they will punt it. We'll do an all-out block. Just everybody get out of the way. Get the ball back. Get out of the way. That was a good punt. It just ended up in the end zone. I think it got right down on the two or three yard line. So we're in the middle of the field. Let's try... Let's do a counter play. We're going nickel. Man. Shifting that way, which I'm all for. Good blocking there. Loving the counter. Great play. Great, great play. So we're running the ball good. That's That gives me a little bit of comfort that at least you can run it halfway decent. Uh, let's go back. Uh, let's go strong. Give it a different look. Let's go back to flank or curl. Go zone. Yeah, okay. We can go to our tight end here. I'm going to use a little motion. Everybody, brother, brother shifting that way. There we go. Good to see our tight end again to touch the ball at least a little bit. Pick up four. What haven't we called? Let's go back here. Pay a counter boot. Well, let's go back to flanker curl. Let's get an old school West Coast look. They're going zone. I am going to leave the slide protection as is. No, that's good defense. The uh, my wide receiver got stuck here, and that's what kept that corner from going up. He just stayed right here, so he was able to defend two guys at the same time pretty easily. We're very fortunate that wasn't picked. It is third and one. We got plenty of time. Let's do something really quick. I need to try X the dig Z way up, but that's a little slow. Let's go tight end corner. Okay, they're going zone. We'll go to our wide receiver here. Pick up a first there. Ooh, stay in bounds. So we're going to stay in this formation and go back to that play I just mentioned. We haven't got to call it yet. This is a great formation for West Coast. Several good plays in it. X dig Z whip. So they are going zone. And this is an interesting play. Well, I'm going to see if I can pull this off. Especially against zone. We're going to shift everybody and their brother to the right. I didn't get the first, but that's a good zone beater. Normally, it's not. It's kind of hard to show it here, but if you time it right, sometimes this corner can like over pursue a little bit because he's so used to guarding this guy coming over. 
that you get a lot of space over here for your zone beater, which is the whip. But they put decent defense right there. Uh, it's minute 53. Let's go. Let's just stay in this formation. Let's go deep comeback. Stay in zone. All right. I'm going to try to hit this comeback. We got plenty of time. We're going to shift to the left. There we go. Get out of bounds. First and 10. We're on the 14. We got time. Let's try. I'd like to be able to... Let's do this inside counter with our backup halfback. We're going man. I don't know how well this will work, but it's counters, so at least it'll be quicker. Oh, it's gross. It's not our backup. Dang it. Hey, we're starting to get some yards out of it. Get in the end zone. We're going to decline that. I completely forgot it's the near formation, not far. Great little run, though. You go back and look at this. They shifted to the right, which helps. You can't flip this play, unfortunately. I thought Super was going to be the guy going to run the ball here. That's why I picked the play. So, did anybody counter? Oh, yeah. Yeah, he countered, but he... Stayed up front, which actually helped. He actually picked up that middle linebacker. Either way, the counters work halfway decent. I like that. Work a whole lot better than an 06. So a minute 28, I gave him plenty of time to try to do something on their last drive before half. But as you can tell, their defense isn't giving me a whole lot of stress. If you give me time to throw, I mean, I'm going to tear you apart. Louisville, had, a, I guess, had a good enough defensive line where they gave me enough fits to force me to make bad throws. Uh-oh. Saved a touchdown right there. Saved a touchdown. Great run here. Just perfect blocking. Nobody was able to get anywhere close to him. Good block there, and he's off to the races. So the only guy who had a chance was this guy right there at the very top, and I took him over right there just in time to where I didn't get blocked by 27. Ended up saving a touchdown. Whew. We'll go quarters. I assume there's going to be a passing mode here. Going counter. It's able to make the tackle. Let's do a zone blitz. I think they got a pass now. Nope, they're going to run it. Good pickup on the block right there. Wow. That's what we're supposed to see from that guy. Plays like that. The counter play worked. Look at that blocking. Then he just made that guy look like a fool. Well, that's good to say that their, their impact guy, impact halfback, actually made a good play. First one of the day. So that gets it down to three touchdown lead. We got a minute and 11. Ooh, it'd be curious to see if we can get down the field in time. <coughs> Took him 10 seconds, two plays. We do get the ball started second half. Let's see if Super can do something here. We're on the right hash. We kind of need to get down the field, don't we? Let's go here. Let's see what's available to us. Let's go split in drag. Ooh, man, we may have a hard time getting this playoff. They're going man. Wide open. Huge play. Huge play. The flag route worked like a charm. Wow. He was beyond wide open. And that is the reason why I went to him. The flag routes work a little bit better in this game because of how wide open he was. And one of the reasons why he was so wide open 
I may use one of that as a thumbnail. Oh, I could have had a better one. Okay, let's go back here. So you look at the matchups. We know that this linebacker is on this receiver. And I'm guessing that linebacker is not as fast as my flag route. Normally, when you see that type of separation with a flag route in this game, you're going to see this guy spin a little bit. See, as soon as I make my cut, what's he do? He cuts like that. He makes a turn the other way. And by the time he does that, look at the separation. I mean, there is like no chance for that guy to get over there. No way. Unless you're Lawrence Taylor, maybe you can chase him down. But there's just no way. But that's why I went to him, because that was just a basic matchup uh, that I was looking for. And that was a perfect route to go up against that matchup. But the fact that he made that turn makes all the difference. So when you see that from a defender, you may want to throw it to that particular route. Because he tends to turn the opposite way, slowing him down a little bit. Then it's just off to the races after that. So maybe we'll only score 70 today. Still giving them a full minute to do something. Ooh, almost blocked it. So like I said, what we're going to do is go back down to five going forward. Because right now, and my offense is playing flawlessly, but my offense playing flawlessly does not need to put up 700 yards in the game. That's too much. That's not very realistic. And I think I kicked it right to their impact player. And I did. Oh, they're going to do the reverse. Nope, they're going to fake it. We're going to take a knee. They do have the fake reverses and reverses off the kickoff, which is pretty cool. We'll do quarters. They'll start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Going eye tight. I'm thinking they're going to run here. Full back dive. Just got nowhere to go. We'll just let that clock roll. I have no desire to hurry up, get the ball back, and try to score before half. There's no point. Uh, we'll go back to the bear front. I could do a, a, an extreme under front, something like that. Don't know if that's going to help. Attack these A gaps. Didn't get the snap. Got about four yards out of that. Five yards. And this should be the last play. See, that's a lot of yards already for both teams. Go back to a 4-3. Technically, it's a 5-3. Technically, it's a 4-4. I just however you want to call it. I like the way it looks. The old 85 Bears. I just thought. Awesome defense to watch. All right, halftime, we can check out some stats. It'll be interesting. 342 yards of offense. Again, that's way too much. I mean, that's... And I know, like I said, my offense is playing about perfect. Technically, it's not perfect. I mean, we've already had five incompletions. But the running game's going extremely well. 208 yards rushing. Our third down's going really well. The good news is, not a lot of turnovers. That's that's good. That makes me feel, the, you know, warm and fuzzy inside. Not seeing eight <laughs> sitting right there. Uh, the individual stuff I don't care. So let's just go back into this. And what I may do is run some clock just to get through this game. No reason not to at this point. The game's over with. This is my starting corner. A left hash. What can we call? Let's go... I want to run the ball some more. Let's go... Ah, slot? Let's try to run up the gut, see if we can do anything. They're going man 5-2, so I don't think this is going to work, but we'll we'll run it anyways. We may have a chance to go to the right. We'll do a one-snap count. Get off me, son! Where do you think you're going? Boom! Stiff arm. It's a good run there. Uh, let's go. Oh, one thing I can do, I clearly forgot about this. We can go here, and we can do fullback over with our halfback. 
or, or yeah, our backup halfback. Now, if you remember, back in the day, I used to do like fullback overs with the tight ends and receivers. I had to do some hand holding to do that. You don't have to do that in this game because you got the uh, H versions of some of these uh, I back uh, formations where your number two tight end or you can swap your you can put your number one tight end at fullback which is pretty cool so you've got like an all-american tight end and you want him to run the ball you can run ih pro strong age pro strong age twins weak age twins really neat stuff Ooh, i think i may want to run the ball some more let's go back just do counter again then we'll try toss right now i have no real need to th throw it they're going man. I may go to the right. Pick up a few. That's good defense by the corner. Kind of sat there and waited, and that receiver just went straight towards the concession stands. I don't know what he was doing there, but second and seven. Uh, we can. Uh, let's try toss from like one of these formations. We got toss in this formation. We should. They're strong toss. Going zone. I would imagine toss doesn't work as well against zone as it would against man. Early jump. I'm going to let that one go. Let that clock roll. Yeah. That's what I figured. So it's what, third and eight? We can. Where's it at? There's a. No, it is in a slot. Scissors in. That's what I wanted. We're going, man. I need the first down, so I may have to go to Williams to pick up the first. I think I can do smart routes. I just don't know them yet. I need a. It doesn't show how to do it here. Like, if you go to settings. Go to, uh, no, go control the layout. Passing, it should be pre-snap, pre-play offense. That's matchup stick. I think for some reason you can do smart routes in this game. Maybe you can't. Somebody told me that you could. I'll have to fool with that later. But they are going man here, so we're going to go to the dig. Mm. First down. Right hash. Everybody's looking pretty froggy right now. Let's go back here and... Let's go with a dive out of ace normal or ace big or whatever they want to call it. I'm going to see if I can be patient and try to go up to gut here. Now, they are going man, so I don't know how well this will work. Eh, it's a good play. Good defense. Uh, pick up three. We can stay here and do X post. I, I don't need my other tight end to do anything other than the blocks. That's a perfect play for us. They are going zone. I'm going to flip. No, we're not going to flip. There's no point in doing that. Our other tight end can't handle it. We'll just go to our half bag. Got them offsides. Well, I decline it's second and seven. Third and one or second and two. Let's do second and two. Right hash. I'm trying to think of something we haven't called. Uh, strong normal. Slants. I don't know if they work as well. I, they may work a little bit better, but let's go flank or curl. Going zone. Love to see the. Middle of the field open right here. Go to our tight end again. We're going to take off the entire quarter if we can. This entire drive. No P is not open. We'll go to our halfback. We didn't get the first. Third and one. He's kind of gassed. Uh, but he, I think he's still okay. Let's go. We're going to attempt lead toss. Probably not the best idea. Since I still don't feel completely comfortable with this play in terms of its consistency, but we may have a chance here. Unless we could draw them off sides again. Go 
going to get a good play right here. Good block. Good block. Touchdown. Great. The toss works. Ah. Man, that's good to see the run game work a little. I was getting really worried that it would be a real struggle in this game, but it looks like you can if you got the players to do it, I guess. You got the right matchups, but great blocking by the pulling guard, by the fullback, then an old school juke to finish it off. Great play. So now that we know uh, that mass subs don't work in this game, they're glitched. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go back to the first game. What I can do here is I have to do this old school. We'll put Super McNair. We'll put Stevens. And we'll mainly do all this stuff. We'll put Williams and Bale. Pascal. And that's good enough there. We'll put quarter. Offensive line. Uh, I'm a little worried about this part, but I think we'll be okay. We'll go Price. Cantrell. That's good enough. We can go here. Uh, Becker. Did I miss him? No, he's right there. And we'll put in Howard. And we'll do the first team offense. Get them out for now. So that didn't take but, what, 30 seconds to do? So it wasn't that big of a deal. Do it old school. Whatever reason, when you try to do the mass subs, it only subs in your skill player. No, it, yes. It doesn't sub in your skill players. It subs in your offensive line, and that's it, which makes no sense. There's a reason why they call it mass subs. We was able to take off four minutes off the clock. I tried my best to run as much clock as I could. Go over here. Last time this guy about took it to the house. That was a terrible kick. Going right to that guy. It's not what I wanted. At least we stopped him. I may want to keep kicking it in the middle of the field because it's so much harder to score. If they run up the middle of the field as opposed to the sides. So that may need to be my strategy going forward. Good defense there. Five on one situation. They don't have a very good quarterback. And we kind of knew that going in by looking at his stats. Uh, let's see if we can do a zone blitz. Now, I'm going to do the mass subs for defense and see what that looks like. That's one thing I did not pay attention to. Was the mass subs for defense. Did that work okay? So what I can do is third and five. Let's just do quarters. We can look here and see. Okay, just making sure. Because that may be glitchy as well. Run play. Wide open. That's a good throw. Had to come all the way over to make the tackle. Uh, let's just stay in quarters. Why not? Looks like I only have to make one pre-snap adjustment Adjustment for my... That's a good... Nah, he was wide open too. Just a bad throw by the quarterback. Uh, just quarters, I guess. It doesn't matter at this point. Back to Ace Twins they go. Halfback draw. Mm. I didn't plug up that gap, and I should have. We'll go back to a one high. Now that they seem to want to run the ball a little bit. There we go. That safety went down a little bit now. Ooh, wide open. A little hitch. Oh, he's going to get a score touchdown. What in the world? That was goofy. They're not giving up at least. Just a broken tackle. That's all that was right there. We'll keep our first string in there. I do have a backup quarterback that can run the ball a little bit, but I don't have any run plays. I don't even... I got, like, power option, but that's about it. So I'm going to... That's a flag. Oh, they didn't call it. He ran to the kicker. I'll treat him as a typical West Coast quarterback. We can go look here. I don't know my players well enough yet. Let's go... I No, I call the timeout. I'm an idiot. Let's go in-game strategy. Craddock, 74 speed. 
and his accuracy just isn't the greatest in the world. That's why if we get that upshot kid, I can really see him starting next season just because of that accuracy. I hope I can run clock with our first team. Or our second team, I should say. We are on the right hash, kind of, sort of. Let's go. We may need to stay in 21 personnel for a lot of this. Uh, let's flip it. We're going man. Now with Super, I can probably get to the outside even better. With him just because of his speed. I threw that way too late. That was that was a quick curl. No, that's just good coverage by the defender. So the curl's not always guaranteed. The curl is much better this year, or an 07. But that defender just played it well. Uh, let's try the toss play with Suber. Love the shift. All right, let's go to the left and see what happens. That's ah, great play by the defender right there. He was great pursuit. Tight end missed him bit big time. So now it's what third and seven ish. Uh, that's what we can do. Go deep comeback. They're going man. So I'll probably audible. I hope I done that correctly. Good little catch by McNair. Don't know if that's if we stayed in bounds or not. We could try a counter from Pro. I'm gonna hurry up to the line and see if we can. Mm, I don't like that shift. We'll we'll go to the half or to the fourth quarter. Okay, let's put in our second string defense and see if there's anything, if that works okay. So let's put second team defense. Let's go back to counter. It's good to see man. Let's see if they shift hard. Uh, we'll spread out. I don't know if, this, if the protection works just as well with the run or not. Eh, not bad protection, not bad. Get a first down. Not bad at all. We can go here. Do ISO. Then we're going to have to start running or throwing the ball because I think Super is getting a little bit gassed. We're going zone. I am going to... We're going to run up the, the right side, but I'm going to try to stay inward if I can. I'd jump the snap got me on that one. Uh, so now we got our back up in there. Drive slot wheel. Hitch corner. Let's do X post. Uh, that's right. Our backup tight end. He's not the fastest. I don't really think he can catch all the way, but it's going to go to him. If I can get over there in time. That clock won't have to... I have to do this quick. Yeah. That took me forever to get that play going. The clock was going pretty quickly. I was real slow on my play selection. That was my problem. So it was third and 11. We'll go back to deep comeback. Go zone. All right, they're going to go zone. We're going to try to hit this comeback again. The clock has stopped. We're six for six on third down. That's, I guess that's pretty good. Yeah. Pick up the first there. Uh, I have... Let's go here. Flinker curl. Let's go back to X post again, but from strong normal. 
or going man. This will end up going to my halfback or my dig on the far right. Yeah. The clock has stopped. Nope. Ain't gonna be able to do anything. Somebody came right on through. It wouldn't even jump the snap. Look, look at this protection. In this gray. Look at my backup fullback and my right tackle. I wonder if this is an awareness thing. If it is, then just get a bunch of smart offensive linemen and you'll be okay. But look at that. That's an Olay defense. So 65 and 41. Let's go back and look. This is how you learn things. Let's go here. Go to our fullback. Backup. 68 awareness. Oh, yeah, no, he's 59 awareness. Then our right guard, or no, our right tackle. 59, 68 awareness. So maybe it's all about awareness. I mean, if that's the case, just find the smartest players you can that's going to block for you. Maybe that's all you need. Okay, uh, we need a lot of help here. Can we do anything from here? Wheel, corner, a lot of short stuff. We'll do deep outs. We'll go old school with it. We're going zone. I need some yards in the worst way. And that guy's, I don't know what this guy's doing. He's, he's stuck on his own defender. Oh, get a little throw. Pick up the first down. I knew who I was going to go to. I was just waiting to see when he was going to be open. And it looked like he was open right there. I mean, just wide open. I mean, because everybody and their brother was blitzing off that side. So I just threw it kind of quick. And was able to get the first. On the 17. Let's try. What? I wish. Um, let's try this off halfback tackle play. I don't run this too often. We're going zone. I love the shift, so this may help us. Anyway, we're going to leave it as is. We're going to run some clock. Even with running clock, I still am over an hour on my video. Touchdown. That's just your basic off-tackle play. I, want, I was curious to see what the blocking would be like, but it looks like we had no issues with that. And our third string halfback got to get a touchdown. So now we're going to get on defense and see what that mass subs looks like. Hopefully it's okay. So as it shows, when I don't turn the ball over, I can win a lot of football games. And thankfully our turnovers, knock on wood, our turnovers have been good for both teams. Even when it's raining. So that's good to see. As long as it's not like every other game, which it still may be like that. We're going to find out really quick. we got a tough game coming up next. I forgot who we're playing. Tennessee. Yeah, we're heading to Tennessee. Ingram. That's my receiver. Out. Oh, that's my top receiver. What's he doing out there on special? Oh, whenever you do that on the depth chart, it moves them back on special teams as well. Oh, man, pray that he's okay. So, that looks like they done it correctly. Except maybe the defensive line. Ah, it's a good pickup on the block there. Oh, wow. That looked way too easy. Looked like a little 09 issue there with a bad pursuit or 08. My backup safety just fart. I mean, he just pooped on his paint, you know, all over himself right there. They still got their first string in there. So they're going to do an onside kick, I guess. So much for that defense. But I think, let me go back and look. 98, 90, 87, or 97. 92 to 55. Okay, so yeah, it done it correctly. So it looks like defense mass subs works okay. It's just on offense, only subs in half of them. So their impact halfback got to make another big play, but it's way too late. Oh, a great block. Awesome, that guy came right on through. So it looks like you can block him in this game. Uh, this guy, I don't know. Let's see, what's, what's he doing here? 
it's like a, a, a butt block. I don't know what it's just... Uh, either way, killer block there. This game is goofy. 07 just has more goofy things in it. Than 06, that's for sure. We'll do a kick return, but they're going to onside kick this thing. Hopefully this works. Last time we tried this, they was able to get the ball back. Well, that is... That's a flag. Yeah. So they are doing the onside kick correctly. So what I need to do is... Let's do onside recover. Apparently this works a little bit... Hopefully this will work better because my old strategy may not work anymore. And look at that. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Well, I'm gonna put my first string back in there. First string defense. I got to now. I just... They're gonna score real quickly again. That was a perfect... You go back and look at it. Knock, bounce right off the guy's leg. Merk. So that gives you, that's some hope if you want to be a real onside kick guru. You can probably recover those more in this game. Now I wonder, they're, they're going to run with their fullback. Well, if that's the case, let's just do one highs. So I haven't heard much about our wide receiver yet. I guess he's okay. Intercept that. Mm, that should have been picked. Second and ten. Uh, let's do a zone blitz. The good little play by the half Mac. So it's third and five. We'll do quarters. I'll control a defensive lineman. I'll leave it as is. That's a good little play. First down. Pretty easy. We'll just stay in quarters. I'll go back into coverage. Well, they're not giving up. Going with the quarterback play. I can't see what's happening. Close line, yeah. No Boom! Second and ten. I'm just going to stay in quarters. I'm going to see if I can force an interception. Ball on the -yard line. No, I don't like that. Go back. Ah, dang it, that may mess me up right there. Good defense. Third and ten. I'm, I'm gonna stay in quarters. I need to quit doing that extra adjustment. Don't have to do it anymore. Wide open. Yeah, it's a good play. Yeah, I probably should have been over there to help. First to ten. Let's do an under front. Go lightning gold. Uh, they're gonna go pass. I didn't. Shouldn't have done this. Was able to make the tackle. I want to do a zone blitz. Do they got a basic zone? Okay, they got a lightning too. So they moved those other zone blitzes I had in 06 over to the other two, four, three formations. Somebody got to him. Good to see a defensive lineman get to him. That's good. That's third and 12. I want to do another type of cover three. Like Hulk three, it's kind of like a cover six, but I don't, But with the blitz. It takes forever for that corner to get over. Let's do this type of zone blitz. Oops. Completely whiffed on that tackle. That's the perfect play call. I had the blitz off that opposite side. Look how wide open he is. Cover three, you can find this place wide open. And they give it to their best player to do so. 
But on the seven. Uh, let's go. Let's do cover one. Almost got the first. Go Thunder Green. Ah, dang it. I got to him, but not in time. So they're putting up their points. It's almost like when it gets when they get blown out in the fourth quarter. That's when things start to happen, or third quarter. If you remember our first game against Florida International, it was kind of the same situation. It feels like the exact same game. They make a big comeback towards the end. I mean, they're still down a bunch, but... Now, what worries me here is... I'm going to do the kick return. Have everybody get out of the way, see if this helps again. Except this time... That's a good little kick right there. Thankfully, it went out of bounds. That was a good try. So they're doing a whole lot better on the onside kicks. That's good. And I got my first string in there. Let's do... Or second string, sorry. Let's do a toss. Let's see if we get Super going. We're just going to run the ball and try to end this thing. Like the shift. Good block there, and a fumble. He got his bail rung big time. We'll do counter lead, and they're not going to stop the clock, which is good. I won't be able to do a... I won't be able to take a knee until we get a first down. Oh, that's a hard shift. We'll still... Uh, let's go to the... We'll go to the right. Nope, ain't happening whatsoever. Wow. Not a chance. It's third and forever. I'm still going to run the ball, force them to call a timeout. We'll do our basic toss this time, see what happens. Gross is our player of the game. Had a great game. Only 14 carries, 185 yards. They're going to get the ball back, and they're going to make this like a two-score game. You wait and see the way they've been playing lately. Ah, I should have went to the first down marker. I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm an idiot. Let's go offense. I'm going to go for this thing. I don't care. The game's over with. Um... They're going goal line, aren't they? Or a 4-6, basically. Yeah, pick up the first and end it. Good deal. All right, we'll take a knee and end this thing. If I can get to it. Special teams. There we go. Should only take one snap. Even with me running clock today, my video right now is a minute, thir an hour and thirteen minutes. Whew. You can't fake snap on a QB Neil. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, good win. We're at two and one. We'll check out some stats. We gotta check our injury report as well. Those are some good looking uniforms. That's just a good color combo. The mullet looking sharp. Alright, let's go. Stats and scores. We had 500 yards of offense, and that was with us running a ton of clock. Uh, 223 yards rushing. That was good. That was probably my happiest thing to say was that right there. That we could actually run the ball some today. Uh, and here's probably the more exciting thing. One turnover total. There was three technical fumbles, technically, but only one of them was an actual turnover, but we've seen a lot worse. 
Uh, let's go to individual stance. Marks, 13 of 18, 221, two touchdowns. More importantly, no picks. Rushing gross, by far his best game of the season. Four touchdowns. Did he catch the ball any today? I don't think he did. Yeah, he got two catches, but only six yards. But as you can see, a lot of guys got to touch the ball through the air today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight guys got to catch the ball. And it was good to see our tight end get to touch the ball a little bit. He only got 26 yards, but at least he got involved. No pancakes whatsoever, but that's kind of always been like that in these games. Defense, Rainey, our outside linebacker. This is the guy that I normally control. Had nine tackles today. Good for him. And we got to see a couple sacks. Not bad. And then we only gave up one sack. And uh, now let's go to... Well, it, the injury report... We can't see the injury report from here. So let's go to a wide receiver. Ingram. Out for a quarter. It didn't tell us what was going to happen. They, I don't remember seeing it. It may have shown and I must have missed it. But for some reason, I don't think it showed that he was out. Either way, thankfully, it's not serious. So my next video is going to be, we're going to go back to Hawaii, play a game there, and then we're going to come back and probably play two to three of this dynasty. Next up, at Tennessee, they're 2-0. and I'm guessing they're going to play somebody today, probably Florida, if I had to guess. So they may be 2-1 and one by the time they come in here. Anyway, you look at their stats. It's monstrous. They're incredible. Got as good as talent as anybody. And we're going to be playing in Neyland Stadium, which is always fun for me. All right. Like I said, next video will probably be our next Hawaii Dynasty game. And then we'll come back and play 2-3 to three of MTSUs. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.